Hello, my name is John Lee, and I'm the president of Alpha Training and Consulting, and I have a true passion for preparing students for ASQ certification exams. But today we're going to answer the question, how do we, I become an ASQ CQPA, Quality Process Analyst, a great certification, by the way. And step one to becoming a CQPA is get the desire and the prerequisites, fulfill the prerequisites. What are the prerequisites for the ASQ CQPA? Well, here it is. Candidates must have two years of work experience. Okay, two years of work experience or an associate degree or two years of equivalent higher ed education. So if you have an associate's degree or higher, you can go take the test today. No problem. That waives all the requ work requirements. But if you don't have an associate's degree or higher, you need two years of work experience. That's what really makes, I think, the CQPA unique, is it doesn't have a heavy burden to take the test. Now, before you go take the test, you may want to go to the ASQ website and make sure this hasn't changed. But uh, I don't think it will. But just in case, it doesn't hurt to check in there again. Now, step two, prepare to take the exam. This is the most time-consuming element of the whole becoming a CQPA. I hope you'll consider my uh, class. I have an excellent online class, and you can learn more about that class by going to asqcqpa.com, and that will teach you a little more. We teach many ASQ certification exams. We've been doing it for over 20 years, and we've become very good at it, and we'd love to have you as a student. This is uh, what we... These are all the lectures and the time for each of the lectures that we have for the CQPA test. So it's pretty thorough, but it's a very good class and will give you a high probability of passing the certification exam. So that's step two, most time-consuming step, uh, prepare for the exam. Sign, step three, sign up for the ASQ CQPA exam. And uh, that's more, it's not difficult, but there's a few steps you have to understand. So please watch my video entitled, How to Sign Up for an ASQ Exam. And that will give you everything you need. Now, this one is on the February time schedule. Uh, and what that means is that ASQ tests on CQPA every other month, starting with February. So it's going to be February, skip March, then it will be April. Uh, then it'll skip May and do June, etc. Every other month. I know, by the time you listen to this, these dates will be obsolete. However, just remember, every other month, and it's the beginning of uh, usually the first week, as you see, 4th, 7th, 6th, and 3rd, 1st or 2nd week is when it starts, and then it goes for a couple weeks uh, every other month. And again, listen to the ex uh, video that I give you, how to sign up for an ASQ exam, and that should answer all your questions. Uh, this is where you'll find the latest dates is at this uh, website here, at the ASQ website. All right, uh, what's the probability of passing the exam? So take the ASQ exam, what's your probability of passing? Well, we look at the whole population, it's 72%. Uh, my class is more in the 90s, okay? So we have an excellent class. CQPA, 72%. It's tied for six is the highest pass rate. They have 18 of them. So it's a, still a challenging exam, don't get me wrong, but there's definitely more challenge, challenging ones. And what do I estimate the time it will take you to prepare for this? Remember, that's the most time-consuming element, is uh, preparing for the exam. I, with my class, it will be right around 100 hours. All right. Now, step five is pass the ASQ, ASQ exam and celebrate. You know, it's time to celebrate now. Uh, quality process analysis, I looked it up on all these different websites and uh, took the average, and it's a salary of 66495 Now, that may not be true for you. Obviously, that depends on education, what industry you work in, etc. I have a video on that, too, uh, on salaries for ASQ exams, so you can check that out where I go into greater detail on this to give you a better idea for your particular situation. Well, thank you for joining me in this uh, uh, lecture. And remember, I have uh, passed most of the ASQ certification exams, and I'd love to join you on your ASQ certification journey. Uh, here's my main website here, www.alphatc.com. Go to that website, go contact us, send me a message. I'd love to hear from you, and I'll get back with you as soon as possible. Thank you, and have a great day.
Goodbye.